I'm filming. Okay, so uh, I have this uh, thing here. This is, by the way, using uh, Allison's, Allison Parrish's grammar, but I wrote the code. And, and it's it, a context-free grammar. Oh, and your phone probably. Ooh, the lighting. What? It's what good. Happened, what happened with the lighting? The black is here, and then there's like gray, and here's darker gray at the edges. Just, just, know. just show the project. You're so, out of focus. So, again. if I, uh, uh, I'm gonna, don't focus. shake my phone. And Stay now, uh, if I get, now, if I hit generate, <laughs> it generates a sentence in it. Damn that corsage sneezes. <laughs> Do you know what a corsage is? I don't know. That's something that women used to wear. It's sort of like um, a top that that would yeah, it's sort hold of their like, breasts together. Uh, th this is sort of like Mad Lib Generator. Waist. Sort of like a Mad Lib Generator. If I hit... Uh, no, if I... Oh! <laughs> <gasps> that I can't read. Yeah. Ooh. Is it a random spot on the screen? Yeah, it's a, on a random spot. Ah, oh, there we go. Sim, каждый раз, когда ты прыгаешь, у меня фокус теряется, потому что ты прыгаешь. When I get closer. No, if you get too close, it's also not good. But when I, when I, but when that I... amoeba that whines daydreams. This is kind of nice. The amoeba that's like a generate all and it now uh, gonna one cell organism and that it daydreams. This the this dichotomy that wine sneezes. Those are the same words. There aren't that many words there, are there? You have actually entered the words by hand, right? Can you show me the code now? Uh, let's check. Let's just run right one more sentence. Okay. Oh, this restaurant computes that important corsage. <laughs> I like the first two better. Show me the code. Sim, каждый раз, когда ты прыгаешь, я тебе фокус. This is in the uh, P5 uh, IDE. Uh, I have this, uh, I have data, this, this is actually the grammar itself. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, you can see, uh, this, this is the sentence itself. This is, uh, I got a noun phrase. So, so the sentence can be a noun phrase, then a verb phrase, or an interjection, and noun phrase and then a word, <laughs> verb phrase. Noun phrase can be either a determiner, a noun, a noun, now or turn now that and then a verb phrase or turn or adjective now that verb phrase is either v trans I don't know what that is it's a transitive verb transitive verb noun in a noun phrase or an intransitive verb. An intransitive. That means that the, the verb requires a preposition. So then then an interjection. That's oh my wow or damn. The terminer is this, that, the, then noun is um, um amoeba. The Chotomy, Seagull, Corsage, well, we don't have to read all of them. Corsage, we're not, we're not going to read all of them. Bulb, adjective, bald, smug. Bold. A adjective is... is bold at the least, is like. Bold, smug, important, tame, overstaffed. Lu luxurious. Luxurious, blue. Transitive verb, computes, examines, foregrounds, prefers... Interpret spins, then, then intransitive in, verbs, in, intransitive coughs, coughs, coughs daydreams, whines, slobbers, wo vocalizes, sneezes, then then and then right here I'm uh, creating the grammar. This, by the way, is not the grammar itself. It, I said it's the grammar itself, but this is just a raw, it's just a raw, like, the version of the grammar. I, I need it to be, like, a tracery grammar that can, 
actually generate sentences for us. So I, uh, creating the grammar here, like this, and then, and then I have a button, uh, this is a, a generate button, and then I have a, a clear button, then I have a results array where I just store everything. Then, then, uh, I'm, I'm using the canvas as my background here. Uh, and I'm just, I am um, uh, setting the background to 51. Oh, something that I've noticed here. I, I still have the uh, background here. It's, I think it's going to still work if I do this later. Uh, I, I, uh, I'm creating the grammar. I have a, a generate button, then a space, and then a, a clear button. And I have, a, in my draw, I, I just have just looping through this. And uh, when I, ooh, lighting changed. It's darker. Uh, I have a background. Uh, I have uh, I'm looping through all the results. Drawing all of the, uh, this is, by the way, expansion is the sentences themselves at a random x and y you can see that down here random x y uh then i'm uh saying uh when i clear them all uh i set the results to an array i i set the results back to an, an empty array then then uh i'm calculating the expansion which turned out flattened this is actually e computing the expansion. Computing is kind of the right word. It's also kind of the wrong word, but x y. I ping a random x y result. Stop push. I'm 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 I I I'm storing the expansion and storing the x and then storing the y. Okay. This and this is all your own code. My own code. The the, the Al, Alison Parrish's uh, grammar. Mm-hmm. Great. Uh, it's quite a lot of fun. Only it's a shame that there are not that many words. You can add words though. You can add your own words. But, uh, I'm just gonna show you the grammar here. This is the grammar. This is the website that where you you got it from GitHub. And. This is Allison's page. I don't know why it's so dark. We should probably stop this video because we're filming it on vacation and the conditions are not the best. 